How to change the lock screen shortcuts on the Samsung Galaxy S22. Welcome to one of how to smartphones tutorial videos. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to change your lock screen shortcuts, which are right down here. And I'll also be showing you guys the double click side feature shortcut. We'll be changing that as well. So as you guys can see, I double clicked that side button and the camera turned on. And for whatever reason, um, these shortcuts are set. I have another camera and a phone. Um, if you are, if those are f features or functions that you normally typically don't use, um, which I don't, I mean the phone, I, I usually, I'm usually in my phone, I'm re um, calling back to a missed call, something like that. So I don't really use that function. I'm always in the phone. When I use it, uh, the camera, I've already have a double, double click function set there, a little shortcut set. So it's almost like a waste. And um, I, I use my flashlight fairly frequently. So I'm just going to go ahead and um, show you guys how to change that. So uh, we're going to go ahead and scroll down. We're going to get into settings. Go ahead, select the little gear icon at the top right. From the settings, it'll take you to this screen here. We're going to go ahead and scroll down until we see lock screen. Select that. From here, we're going to go ahead and scroll down until we see shortcuts. So we're going to select that. Here's showing us that it's on. Left shortcut is the phone and the right shortcut is the camera. Shows a little di diagram of what it looks like. So let's go into the phone here. Um, these are some of the more basic ones, the flashlight, do not disturb, uh, calculator, say you have some kind of app, some kind of game that you're constantly playing that you want to have on there. Let's say you like videos and you want to have your YouTube on there. YouTube is there. Um, if we want to change the right camera or the right one from camera to, let's say flashlight, I do like my flashlight. It's nice to have handy instead of having to unlock your phone. It's right there. Um, so I'm going to go ahead, set that to flashlight. So I'm just going to go ahead, leave this screen and I'm going to show you guys that on my lock screen. Now I have my YouTube and my flashlight. So I swipe. Boom, just like that, my flashlight turns on. I swipe again, turns the flashlight off. Same thing for YouTube, swipe, YouTube turns on, and just like that. Um, so if we wanted to change the um, shortcut button for the side button here, same thing, we're gonna scroll into our settings, swipe down, hit settings. From there, we're gonna go ahead and scroll down till we see advanced features. From advanced features, we will be going into the side key tab. So from right here, there is a double press, which right now is currently set to uh, launch a camera. And then it, it, there's a preset. Mine, I've, I've already messed with it. So it does have, I've already set my flashlight as um, the other option. If you don't want to set that, you have to select the flashlight. Hit the gear. Um, maybe you just have to hit it. You might not have the gear if you just hit it. If you haven't set it up yet, it'll take you to that same list of all these apps. Um, if you want to get into messages, Netflix, you know, YouTube again, notes, whatever it is you want to set. Um, let's just change it to calculator. So now I have it set to calculator. So when I double click, that brings up my calculator. Something handy to have if you're constantly crunching numbers. Boom, boom, double click. There you have it. Um, so go right back in here into settings. So and press and hold um, is no normally set to wake Bixby. So Bixby is not a thing that I use that much. So when you press and hold it, it brings up this Bixby page. I find it kind of annoying sometimes. I'd rather power off my phone. So as you guys could see, I did have that set to power off mode. So just like that, you can switch it over to power off mode. So press and hold takes you to that screen, something that it would normally was before all these changes started happening. Just like that, you can restart, power off your phone. So nice quick little shortcut there as well. So there you guys have it. Just my quick way of different shortcuts, how to set them, how to change them. I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with anybody who might need this or is looking for this information. And if you guys like to see other helpful tips and tricks on the Samsung Galaxy S22, be sure to check out that playlist in the description below. This, this video was asked, this information was asked for by a subscriber, so I put it all together and here it is. Thank you guys all for watching. Have a good day.